Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, speed gaming fans. I'm WXFan21, joined by the man, the myth, the legend. It's MM2 Nest Cartridge. MM2, how are you? I'm pretty good. How about you, Wixfan? Good, thank you. So, we have Simo versus Derp on the uh, restream. However, we have. You ready for this? We got 27 people competing in this qualifier. So, we got the restream for you all. But keep in mind, this is the third of eight qualifiers. And if you out there, you're like, I have no idea what this is, but it looks like fun. There's plenty of other qualifiers for you to get involved with. Yep. We should have a really good one here, MM2, here on the restream between Simo and Derp. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we get to have fancy pickings for the restream. Um, but trying to keep it, uh, as much variety as possible with the runners we put on restream. Don't want uh, anyone to have to miss out on their shot but yeah five more qualifiers tuesday thursday two next saturday and sunday so should be a great time simo making the correct decision going right derp going left <laughs> so i'm i personally am a fan of going right um and derp finding west ocean immediately simo finding the screw attack immediately rewarded this is what you want to see got it so the next time i play one of these seats myself go right is basically what you're saying yeah, it, um, I do actually think it's better to go right, um, in part because um, you're just more likely to find like a single item room and then have to go left, but you get yep. that extra item and it's just so much more beneficial versus going left, you can find stuff like West Ocean. You can also find that going right, but I feel like it's less likely and see now Derp is just doing what Simo's done, but is slower exactly. at it. Exactly. Also Derp playing a split screw, I think he's probably going to die of cringe eventually. <laughs> Well, either way, both of these runners, no stranger to any Super Metroid rando. Simo, I'm not super familiar with. Derp, I obviously am more familiar with, but one that I was commentating on recently, Simo crushed the competition. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Simo um, is a longtime rando runner. I've been friends with them for a couple of years at this at this point. Um, known RBO and low ice enthusiasts. Um, they're very good about those categories. Um, also, like I said, have been very good at rando for the past couple of years. Um, they were on the winning rando league team for season four. Um, they're more um, specialized in the more esoteric stuff. They came up with Beast Ocean, which is the way to get across the East Ocean with nothing in area rando. So that sounds outstanding. Yeah, yeah it's <laughs> in, it's incredibly stupid, but it's funny. Um, but yeah, a pretty simple start. Um, we got West Ocean, Simo Finding Morph, and... And Spring, Spring Ball. Tank. Yep, Spring Ball as well in the bottom of West Ocean. So, Derp just, uh, just going, getting that morph out of the top left of Gauntlet, and just going to be a little bit behind in the early game. <laughs> you know what's interesting, MM2, is that Spring Ball is going to open up some pretty interesting movement sets here if we find any, like, waterlogged rooms early. Yes. We can be able to do some pretty interesting movement. And I think we should probably explain to everybody what the preset is, because there are a lot of people watching and are interested in this map rando tournament. What yep. are the settings that we're playing with? And if anyone wanted to pick this up, what can they basically be expecting? Yeah, so this is the first map rando tournament of any any sort. Um, it's, it's I'm really excited to get to organize it but yeah like you're saying the settings are hard difficulty tricky map layout uh and default quality of life so expect a little more quality of life um than in a lot of other sm randos um you're gonna get supers dealing double damage to mother brain the revamped map um bunch of other stuff and um additionally you're gonna be expecting to like do the same level of stuff that you are in traditional competitive rando um like you're gonna expect to be expected to do a lot of wall jumps a lot of um common movement uh ibjs spring ball jumps um some trickier wall jumps um just a, a bunch of different stuff some suitless as well who you finding speed booster huge speed yeah. booster find yeah. dirt peaked it and is like yeah i need to go and get that yeah, yeah, I didn't see Dirt Peak it, but Simo definitely getting it, as well as the Supers in addition, and an E-Tank. So yeah, good yep. start so far. Yeah, I personally yeah. want to give all of you a shout out from Aussie and everything that he's been doing behind the scenes. I know this is something he wanted to do. I know I've heard Eddie talk about it. I've heard Oats 
talk about it. I've heard many racers talk about wanting to do something with this map, Rando. And I've played some of these seeds. Not only playing it, but watching it. This they're so fun because you never know what room is behind the next door. Yeah, it's a really neat experience. It's really unlike any other randomizer. So um, I just heard that um, I've heard through Eddie that uh, the map random community wanted to do something with it. At the time, I wasn't really playing map random that much. And then I just got into it. Um, really just got um, got a grip on it and then decided to put a tournament together since SG Live was coming up anyways. Uh, Derp getting the two E-Tanks that Simo has hasn't gone to Sky Missiles yet for the super for speed, so still just going to be a little bit more behind. Um, but Simo exploring the top right at landing site. Um, uh, there is this butterfly room here. Uh, that might be a soft lock? Question mark? Yeah, that's a soft lock. Yeah, it's a soft lock. Oh, no, it's not. Nope. Ooh. Okay, Simo, yeah. Simo knows the tech to get out of there. He's nice. He's going to do a crouch jump and uh, get hit by an enemy at the right time. Nice and, bombs. Yep, yep, you can get through it. Very nice. And then gets the bombs as a reward. Um, Huge reward as yep. well. MM2, something we need to, you know, be thinking about here. You know, both of these races, this is very linear going forward. We're getting our initial items. We got our Morph Bomb, Spring Ball, Screw Attack, and Speed Booster. But once routes start diverging, anything can happen. Yep. Yeah, so a lot of times Map Rando has a more, like a linear sort of beginning, and then it'll end up being, um, you get out of that early game, and then you have a bunch of areas to choose from. And some of those areas will have bosses, some of them will not. And you just get to all the boss areas as quick as possible. And that can involve picking the right areas, it can involve finding the suits as well. So it really just depends on what the seed exactly requires. But this definitely looks like an, a sort of a linear early game. And eventually we'll get the map, maybe not. We'll find. Maybe we'll find another area first, it really just depends. Mm -hmm. And the two biggest things, if you're interested in playing map rando casually, if you want to get involved with the tournament, you want to get involved with the community races, this is, you know, like MM2 and MM2 and I have been saying, it's very different from any other SM rando. Save often, save early and often. And oh, yeah. the second thing is you want to gain access to the map stations as quick as you can. Nice speedball there from Simo getting through the 230 hallway. They did have bombs to do it, but just a little bit of swag and also saving time. Um Yeah, now we're actually very close to the um criteria map, so Map station, like you're saying, is one of the most important things to find in Map Rando. Uh, so you're also going to check the spooky item just because you're here. Might um, as well. But yeah, obviously, since we don't know the maps, since it's randomized, um, it is extremely important to get to all the map stations. Oftentimes, when you're finding a new area, your first thing is going to be pause, check to see the map location, and then just chase that down until you find it. And then whatever you run into on the way, you run into. One thing that's interesting is the amount of big rooms that we have found here early west ocean top ocean and not only that you get wrecked ship now we got bottom by fan two. like there is these are a lot of doors for criteria and i don't know if it's just these settings how it's populating but like i know aussie and i have commentated some seeds where criteria has just been a huge area and okay. this one being yeah. really no yeah, surprise here. how huge yeah. it is again. Yep, so we got another, um, we got mini Kraden that a major to the left. Also, um, yeah, Seamer's going to reset the save, which is just a little time save. Probably going to chase that moat major first. Um, shouldn't be too bad. They have uh, spring well to get across the other way. So, also gets a missile. Durf finds Ridley. Um, I think this is still criteria. Yeah, I think this Looks is like a, yeah. Yeah, this, yeah, this is still criteria. Simo finds the gravity suit. Okay. Yeah, now we're cooking. So, gravity suit, great item. Um, really, like I think the more restrictive of the two suits, since you need a variety of different items to get past suitless things. Whereas Varia, you just need a bunch of energy tanks. But also, it really depends on the seed what actually ends up blocking your way if you get high jump early. Yep. Um, and you see Simo yeah. again doing exactly like we said. Save often. Oh yeah, yeah. So this isn't. I don't think this is just a save to be safe. Um, I think Simo is gonna go somewhere with a major, and then 
if the major is not great, then they might reset and do something else. Could also be chasing wrecked ship here, um, since I was in the top left of the criteria map. Mm hmm. Here's also the um, Hoda Ruby missile major that was up, up here in the top left. Nicely done from Simo. Nice getting the invisible wall. They're going for that same speed ball. I didn't see if he got more bombs. I think he did, though. He did. Market. He's got bombs. And there's Hyden for Simo going into Rex ship now. So Huge find. Yep. Yeah, good find. Dirt probably won't miss it. Just will be a little bit behind. I'm wondering if we're just going to find beams really late. We have every major except Favaria and Space Jump at this point, and we're 10 minutes in, if that. Yeah. Yeah, Favaria, Space Jump, beams, plus Grapple and X-Ray. Um, this is a really nice movement kit. That is a long distance to go for the map. Yikes. So, might try to end up in a different region. Oh, uh, that's Lava not a good dive. place to be. At, nope. That is Turian, though. Yes. Torian, not a bad find here. Yeah, I'm just trying to get a bunch of map uh, depth at this point, but also get the major. So, Derp on his way to, to the gravity suit. Again, just in uh, Simo's footsteps at this point. And there it is. Derp gets the pancakes. Timo now finding the climb. This is a really good room to find, especially if you're trying to go down on here. <laughs> Excuse me. But yeah, that's a bunch of bunch of screens you can go down, so it's a big distance you can travel toward the map. And here's two more items. So, for those that are wondering what the different dots represent on the map is, and Simo finding the map station very nice, you'll see circular dots that are just normal, just like a little dot in the screen. You'll see the open dots. Open dots are supers, power bombs, energy tanks, and I believe reserves. Reserve well. Yes, reserves. Yep, everything that isn't a major or and also isn't a missile. Mm -hmm. And then obviously the big the the big dots are majors the regular dot is just missiles right yes only missiles yeah see so i'm gonna chase these two hollow dots up to, up near the top left of wreck ship map um yep did also find mother brain in the bottom right of wreck ship that's very good information to have here early absolutely is also gonna be using their last power bomb so gonna be a little scared um just don't want to get soft luck but those have morph bombs which makes it a, quite a bit better Mm-hmm. And it looks like Derp is also going to follow that same path toward Wreck Ship. Yep. With the high jump. Now, just like in a regular Super Metroid map, Rando, you still have to be considering what go mode means. You need to figure out if you have charge beam, because you can obviously beat Mother Brain with just charge beam and a certain amount of missiles. But if mm -hmm. you don't come across charge here in a Rando, you need to make sure you have the correct missile count, so... That's why you saw Simo going for some of that early ammo. Plus, we just didn't have a lot before that. Yep. Yeah, early ammo is just good to take care of common enemies in addition to um, going around and all that stuff. Mm hmm. Simo making very short work of Blue Tower. Very nice, actually, considering it's nice to have Screw Attack going up this room. I kind of myself would go back to that Torian door now that you have everything here in the wreck ship mm -hmm. and, you know, just like, okay, I know I have one other area. Yeah, we've also got Meridia and Norfair in Criteria, so mm -hmm. maybe not wanting, wanting to go through Lava Dive just yet. It's kind yeah, of a bit clutch. reckless. Um, but yeah, nice good 
Nice power bomb pickup for Simo. Two power bomb backups is a lot better than one, even with the power bomb drop buff in Map Rando. Yeah, where they drop but, two power bombs instead of one. But I mean, even so, like you were saying, they had none. They had three left after that one. So yep. you you definitely want more of that. Just so much better to use power bombs rather than bombs and speed running. Yeah, power bombs are just super useful. Good to have a lot, a lot of same with super missiles. Missiles are, mm -hmm. missiles are all right. Okay, so Simo finds Brinstar at the top of Wreck's ship. Um, and here's here's the map, right there. Boom. Hello, Brinstar. And Ooh, interesting map. Any Boston? No boss Boston to the right. Simo, go right. Okay. <laughs> He'll get there. Derp is on the right side of Criteria now. Finds Charge. Ooh, Something big find. Big majors. That's a good find. And, and yep. Uh, one major in Brinstar. Yeah, one and major and two E tanks. Really out of the way with. Yeah, I might just turn around. Yeah, I'm not getting that one. That's just out of the way. There's no bosses here. Yeah, and there's a bunch of heat rooms in between now and then. So. Yep. Don't really have the energy, but Simo's trying to make something happen. This is below Spazer over here. Um, Beautifully done yeah. from Derp as well. So Derp has charge. Yes. Now it's a it's a charge pea shooter, but still. Yeah, if Derp can find like one or two other beams, maybe he can make something happen, which would be really nice. Also, I forgot to mark Derp's high jump. Yeah, Derp now at the bottom of Wreck Ship Main Shaft in Criteria. And there's a there's a Meridi transition to his left and then a, a Norfren transition below him, but there's also a major to the right. So gonna chase that major first. I think he took a save at the top of main shaft so that he can reset if that becomes the thing he wants to do. Yeah, and Simo is farming up in Plasma Sparker and this is a great farm. There's Spacer, so... Okay, there's like an actual ward for Derp, aside from Varia. Go ahead. Uh, does not hurt to get... You were just saying, you can get one or two more beams, definitely more manageable. Again, we talked about the Mother Brain fight. And MM2 and I are going to talk a little bit about quality of life and what Mother Brain is when we get to that point in the seed. But there's some pretty cool stuff about it there that... I personally love in map rando and would love to see adopted in some of the other randos because mother brain becomes a lot quicker <clears throat> quicker to kill yeah so Simo really considering that major in his I think Simo's going for it yeah I, I mean I don't know why you stick around in Brinstar otherwise um, there's not really much else out, out, out here nope if it's Varia it's a huge payoff, but okay, Simo is he is yeah. going for it. Yeah, they are going for it. Derp's in Meridia. Um, took that yep. left transition after getting Spazer. So something we haven't seen yet is Meridia. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is a farm room, so Simo can farm here and we'll be fine. Simo needs to be very careful. Yeah, Simo's fine. <laughs> they got to the farm spot. Derp finds Dragon. Um, not really sure why you. Actually, no, I am sure, because you can front health off, off these guys. So actually, a smart call by Dirk. Good job. I would not have done that. <laughs> I would have just gone for Dragon. Like, ooh, Dragon, let's go. Yeah. Monkey brain sea boss. Monkey brain fight boss. <laughs> no, Derp's... Yeah, good job, Derp's, Derp. Derp's farming. Yeah, Derp just wants energy to shine spark Dragon with, and these guys are good sources of that. Mm -hmm. Nice E-Tank there for Simo. Um, really close to the Major at this point. For those that don't know, those guys, if you... There were two enemies in that room. There's the little crab-like looking things, and then there's the green cacks. Green yeah. cacks, if you have less than your full max of supers, they're only dropping super missiles. And the other yeah. ones will drop whatever. Yeah, so the way, the way it works is... Um, if you're full on supers, they have a ridiculously high chance to drop supers, and then if you're full on supers, then that chance gets relegated to the other things they can drop, Oof. which is big health. And that's yeah. it. Ice Beam. Ice yeah. Beam in Brinstar, after the Forgotten Highway. 
Wow. Yeah. Good item, but not really what you want. Um, no, especially yeah. already having speed. Fairy is kind of the only thing you want here. Maybe charge or plasma. But, I mean, I don't know. Ice is... It's not that bad. I'm not going to complain about ice. Absolutely not. The easier of the Zeb skips, too, from what I... Uh, my opinion, just from commentating a lot of these games, looks like the easier way. Oh, yeah, it is. Um, also... Um, it's more feasible in map rando. Derp is on low health. This is this is scary. Yeah. Ooh, he, he, derp. Is, he is in OK right now. Um, Dragon, because of the way suits work in map rando, Dragon's dealing 80 to him, and he has obviously less than that. So yeah, it might be screw attacking through Dragon. Save. OK. Oh. Um, Okay, nice. Makes, makes it happen. Good job, oh, Derp. And Simo is getting out of Rex ship. Gonna mm -hmm. just barely make it. Well done. So back to the Rex ship. So we haven't seen Norfair yet, and that's the only area we haven't come across. We know where it is. It's below Criteria. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, that's the only area we haven't been to yet. Yep, we've we've seen Torian, or at least glimpsed at it. Yeah, yeah, we've glimpsed Torian, um, and we've actually explored all the other areas. Oh, Simo is setting up for a ten power on Crystal Flash. Oh, almost got it. Um, oh, they're in health bomb, so they can't um, <laughs> they they can't get power bomb drops. But yeah, I'm probably just gonna farm these guys at this point. Might as well. Yeah. Um, might end up cl uh, cleaning up the Criterion Majors and or going to uh, Meridia or Norfair at this point. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Dirk gets his Drake kill and then gets dead him, and so he's gonna go somewhere else when it's time. The race is very even right now, even though Derp's already defeated Dragon again. Derp's just in a really interesting spot here in Meridia. Taking out a boss, we don't know if Fantoon and Kratar. We did find Ridley. Ridley's yeah. back in Criteria. Yeah, I don't know. I'd call advantage Derp right now, but it really depends on what happens in the future. Because Derp's up the charge phaser and the drag kill, which is a significant amount. Um, Simo just also has the mother brain knowledge. But probably more likely that Derp just goes to Wreck Ship at the end or later and gets that mother brain knowledge when he has more boss kills. So. Makes sense to me. All right. So, yeah. Okay. Dirt is going back for speed hallway, and yeah, I think this was a bunch of just dead ends at this point. Um. Yeah, not sure why Dirt isn't going to Norfair at this point. Since, oh no, now I am because he's taking a save. Good job, Dirt. Ta -da! Yeah. No, yeah, Derp is barely just gonna go straight to Norfair. Does make sense. You're right here. Yeah. Yeah, you're you're right here. You need to do something that isn't Mahridia since you got the dead ended there. Yep. So uh nice blue bomber attempt from Simo. Good try. This is not great health. I think Simo's gonna get a E tank though. Yeah, this is the yeah. E tank room. And finally, Derp getting some more ammo. Ooh, that map room is close. Yeah, I didn't actually see it because I was looking at Simo's screen. Um, but bottom left, oh, yeah. it's not that far. Yeah, yeah that's pretty close. Um, yeah, maybe you go down a sand pit here. Probably check the left, the other left door as well. Um, Wouldn't hurt. Yeah, I would have just gone right for the left side sand pit. But again, like this is the fun of map rando. Like, you hear how I would do things, you hear how MMM's doing things, Darp's doing something else, and Simo's doing another thing. It's so much fun! Yeah, Derp, yeah, Map Runner is really a special thing. This might be broken map. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, fun bit, fun tidbit about Map Rando is the broken map, which shows up in Wreck Ship and Vanilla, is always connected to the same room as Fantoon. Yep. And then once you kill Fantoon, the broken map will activate. So. Or we just didn't pay Aussie his monthly fee and they shut the map room off. I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't think Aussie has that power, unfortunately. 
Oh, look, yeah. we found Fanta. This is going to be a super small Norfair. Yeah, this is going to be a... This is a Norfair for sure. Simo gets the spade here as well. So yeah, now Simo is back up in even with beams on for derp. Uh, but we'll be down two boss kills shortly, so probably going to be wanting to catch up on those sooner than later at least. Yeah, I think that was like eight or nine missiles there for derp. Uh, first round, not ten, which is really where you want to be if you're wanting to get wanting to get two rounds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, setting up for a good three round. Love supering the power bomb door. It's always silly when you use the wrong ammo type. Yeah, Derp takes down Fantoon. Nice fight from Derp. Also, thank you, Derp, for the better view model. <laughs> it's brighter. Huh. So now, with Fantoon defeated, that is going to unlock every wrecked ship room, but also that map station. So yeah, I, I, it, 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 it's yeah. not going to surprise me to see this being a very small warfare. Yeah, the biggest differences in the wreck ship off and on state are obviously the map station and the, the broken save and the right side super one. Because okay. in the tournament settings, all items spawn from start is turned on. So um, the rooms like Attic Missile, um, Bowling, those items are already there the whole time. But um, right super, there's a robot in the way and in the off state but not in the on state, so you it does actually matter if the ship is on or off. Yeah. Even in this uh setting. What yeah. I, okay. Norfair not small. Norfair very big. Yeah, Norfair's got a large uh lower side to it. And Crade's here. Yep, we did see Crade. Um there's another major there at Climb Supers for Derp. And it is plasma. Okay. Hello. Big beam. Best beam. Yeah. So now that's going to make the Mother Brain fight a lot quicker. Yeah, good Doppler there for Simo, um, fighting Fantoon as Derp just did. Would you consider this go mode here for Derp? Uh, or are you still waiting on Varia? So I feel like right, I'm kind of yeah. waiting on Varia. So right now, absolutely not, because you need Varia or six tanks to survive Mother Brain and Derp right. has five. Um, but more importantly for Ridley, you do want either more tanks or more ammo or both uh there's waves this is hello be... okay yeah this is a good beam for everything uh Durbo yes. is fine with everything at this point still wants um, that varia though. also another super is huge for ridley yep um but i think the biggest thing Durp is looking for is uh just more tanks or varia mm -hmm. so it'll just depend on uh what what comes across his path first so Mother Brain's rainbow beam damage, for those that don't know, is 300 with Varia. Mother Brain, the... I wouldn't call it the AI, the... The game behind it looks for Varia Suit. And with Varia Suit, you only take 300 damage from Mother Brain's rainbow beam. Without Varia, you take 600 damage with six energy tanks. Yeah. Yeah, there's just a there's just a check for Varia. It doesn't check for gravity, but the um, in, in vanilla, there's a extra code to check after Rainbow Beam if you should be damaged on further. Um, so, if you have uh, gravity, then that damage down front threshold is a hundred. If you have uh, very, um, if you have very but no gravity, then it, the threshold is hundred and. 80, I believe, and then gravity, the threshold is... Um, no suits at all, the threshold is 340. But mm. that actually doesn't apply in Map Rando because Mother Brain dies immediately after you finish Phase 2, assuming you don't need to be rainbowed again. But Nerd finds Kraid, while we're talking, just finishes him off. Uh, very and now nicely done. And now Simo's got Wave. Yeah, I didn't see if Simo got Plasma. Did not. No. No. It's still the space of Beamon. Yeah. Yep, I can see off the beams. Um, there's a major in the bottom right of uh, Norfair. Don't know if that's going to end up being important, but it, from Derp's perspective, it has a 1 in 5 to be Varia. 
Um, and you have, yeah, since he still has and, a place outstanding. And, and amphitheater's there, too. Yeah, that Not is a room you want to be in without Vario. <laughs> yeah, it's a scary room, but there definitely has the tanks to conquer it if uh, he has, like, a farm spot beforehand. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, this is probably a save before that bottom right Norfer item. If Makes I sense guess. to me. You'll also notice there are save tanks where they're not normally in the regular game. And that, again, is one of the beauties of Map Rando. It's a quality of life ad. You'll notice it, for example, in the room leading up from Main Street to Crab Hole. There's a save station before the Super Missile Gate. There's a save station in Red That's Tower. Dash. That's Dash Rando. That is not Map Rando. Oh, that's Dash Rando. My bad. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was added to Dash Rando for Area, which is in the other Rando tournament going on, the Mystery Tournament. But Commenting way game. too yeah. much of that MM2. <laughs> it's starting to blend. It's okay, I'm playing both of them. So I I, 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 I've yeah. seen you play both. <laughs> yeah, Map Rando actually has um, no map changes whatsoever beyond what's absolutely necessary. So, I th um, so, they, don't, the so they don't have the one in Red Brin either? Uh, no. No, okay. that was actually Dash exclusive. The uh, oh. the mini save stations. Um, my bad, folks. No, it's all good. It happens to the best of us. You get all random and confused. And now Derp gets to take a nap. Yep. Yeah, Derp's options were either go through amphitheater or wait for Shack Tool. I think Shack Tool is going to be the more popular option since you can also use this on the way back. Yasimo is going to skip this major, I think. Um, does also have the six tanks. If uh, if they get Plasma, this will be real comfy in terms of a Ridley fight. By real comfy, I mean it'll be fine, but it won't be a happy fight. This refill station is real nice, actually. Okay, Jerk coming out. Dirt coming up on the major. Could theoretically be two majors since it's watering hole. And Ooh. gravel. So yeah, not really what he wanted. Unfortunately. No, but yeah. no, but the supers. Yeah, supers are good. Um, but as the number one grapple enjoyer, this is definitely a letdown for a major. Not what you wanted again. We're on the search for Varia suit, folks. Yeah. Varia suit, um, also a couple of tanks would do for these runners, but um, a lot of runners would just want Varia period, which is completely fine. It definitely makes your life easier. But 20 supers is a really good spot to be in, especially with this beam for a Ridley fight. It just wants like two or three more tanks. Okay. Simo's done with Norfair. Derp is uh, probably also close to done with Norfair. Just has to actually get out. And now Simo, it's Simo's turn in Meridia. Yep. Which Derp is finished. So we'll see if Derp yeah. continues to go. You think Derp goes for that bottom left major? Um, with how he's been playing, probably. Um, Simo, what am I thinking? Um, this is Dragon, right? Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. next is Dragon for Simo. Um, but we're not quite sure where Ridley is yet, so. We know he's in Criteria, because we have run into him. Oh yeah, that's right. Derp, Derp did find Ridley. Derp knows where yep. all the bosses are, except for Mother Brain. But Simo doesn't know where Ridley is. Forgot I literally called that out, and then forgot hey, it. <laughs> it's all good. Ha. <clears throat> yeah, so Derp... Yeah, Derp probably is going to check this uh, hollow dot since it's right here. It is only a power bomb, but it's safe to us. Simo doing some uh, any percent strats for Dragon. Yep. Should be comfy territory. Um, but no, okay, now it's less comfy because Dragon's on very low health, but mm -hmm. Super finished it off. Good fight. By the way, shout out to the any percent runners yesterday. Oh, yeah, GDQ was great. I watched. No spoilers, though. No, I didn't watch it. I I caught, I caught bits and pieces. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Simo, 
is now tantalizingly close to the map station, but we'll not actually be able to get there. Because this, I think, dead ends in some item room after Wavegate. Yeah, big scam. You could um, theoretically go down the elevator earlier in Business Center before Dragon. I should. Speaking of Dragon, I should mark it. Uh, Derp is also going to go down the toilet, so I think there's another major down here, which is why he's going down. Like, I was commentating last night a Mega Man X race for uh, SG Live 2024. Nice. And I <laughs> I had the NA% percent race on one tab. I was following the chat for my race. Oh, boy. Another. There's Varia. So. Boom. Derp is in go mode. It It's so... Oh, wow. And Simo never went for it. Yeah, Simo not, Simo's not going to get it. But Simo has seven tanks and a pretty okay beam. If More well, than Simo's, enough. Yeah. Yeah, see, we're not going to get Plasma, though. So... That's going to hurt. Yeah. Really just depends on how quickly Simo finds Ridley, and if that Muggle Brain knowledge advantage ends up mattering. Um, but Derp's just going to be on a tear for Ridley right now, and then probably explore Rex Ship next. Absolutely. So to answer chat, there's currently two Super Metroid randomizer tournaments going on now. Um, there's this, which is part of SG Live Online 2024, and then there's the uh, Mystery Tournament, which is its own thing. And those are those are currently the only two tournaments expected to be played um, for SM Rando throughout 2024. Um, but of course, who knows what happens. Okay, and Simo end up going around, and we'll find the Meridia map, but we'll not find any extra bosses. Um, so this is just a bunch of looking around for Ridley, but we'll not end up finding it. Tragic. Yeah, derp, now back in Criteria. Just gotta head to Ridley. Der Derp's about to go send some plasma shots to Ridley's face! <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. Fresh delivered. And a backhand from Samus to boot! Yeah, plasma wave shots is only gonna take 24, uh, minus however many supers he's using, since those deal yep. 600. Matt, if you yeah. it, if you want to try your hand at Map Brando, come join us. Five more qualifiers to go. It is true. Oh no, Derp got grabbed by the yapping wall. Just gonna have to wah, wah, go wah. back around. It was like fifteen seconds. A modern tragedy. All right, here we go. Back up towards Ridley. Yep, back up the elevator. Simo out of Meridia now. Mm -hmm. So, just gonna have to... They do know Ridley free. is here. Um, yep. So they got the call to either um, chase majors in Norfair or just uh, send it for Ridley. I think they're Five, sending it yeah. for Ridley. 5 plus 2 PRKT beam is on... on on this ammo is this is scary like i i would not have the guts to do this but and this you goes to what we was, yeah this goes to what we were saying earlier like simo was very clearly out in front to start but once the route divergences come in it all depends on what you know what you find and yeah, simo was a little bit ahead out after the early game but so, yeah 
But, but FM2, how come he, how come Derp didn't get grabbed by Ridley? Um, uh, Ridley's, uh, grab counter went up <laughs> ten times. So the way, the way Ridley's death works is Ridley actually has a very com complex AI. Um, so the way it works after he reaches zero health is either Samus gets grabbed and it's a specific condition and he dies or um, he has a grab counter that goes up to 10 and if it hits 10 then he dies. And there's actually some ways to make it go up really fast um, just because of how Ridley's move movement works. It's since it's acceleration based rather than uh, point based. Um, Very good. But yeah. Basically, yeah, they're kind of got lucky, but also not. Gotcha, Matt. Again, it's open to anybody that wants to join. If not, you're more than welcome to watch. Yeah, absolutely. These qualifiers are open to everybody. So, yep. Yeah, anyone is, anyone's welcome. So, MM2, since we've already talked about Ridley's grab counter and how they automatically went like that, let's start talking about Mother Brain and the fight that we're going to be seeing because again there was a huge quality of life change that we're going to find here for mother brain and derp has already been here to the wreck ship i believe no derp is not you can see the map is not filled in so huh yeah simo okay. was in wreck ship i think derp found the high dip and then turned around simo also finding that e-tank so six plus two is getting better for the ridley fight mm -hmm. um but yeah, Derp, um, is, this is his first trip in Wreck Ship, but yeah, he just has to find the map and then he'll find Mother Brain. Yeah. yeah that, yeah, then he'll find Mother Brain. He, so he speaking did of, Ridley, I should mark that. Yep. So speaking of, we have a quality of life setting that I really enjoy here at Mother Brain. And I believe that is, what is it? 10 times the damage with supers. Two times. So the way, times. the way the way it works is supers deal double damage. So normally they deal three hundred to Mother Brain one and two, and they deal six hundred in Map Rando uh, with the setting turned on. Um, there's another quality of life change that ends the fight after phase two. Um, that's the which, that's one of the yeah. big ones. Yeah, which I personally don't prefer, but <laughs> unfortunately, I actually want to organize the tournament with what the community wants rather than just what I like. So. Um, Short Mother Brain 2 is on. Short Mother Brain, not just Mother Brain 2, but it eliminates the cutscene and uh, phase 3 of the fight. So you just uh, go straight to the end and do the escape. Mm -hmm. The and tracker on stream brain. is a custom one from Speed Gaming, but there's a um, but there's like ways to make emo tracker look like this. Um, you just have to put in the right overrides. Can really do almost anything with Emo Tracker. It's a really powerful program. Yeah, Derp finds the Wreckship map and is now just gonna head over to Mother Brain. Unfortunately, he can't back backdoor it, so he's gonna gotta have to go around. Yep. But Simo is fully stocked up and ready for their Ridley fight. Yeah, Simo. 15 supers is not great, but 6 plus 2 is pretty good, and uh, is also going to be able to get some X-Factors, and not like that, though. Yeah, I'm just going to reset. Good good call, just want to get it, get it with as much uh, ammo as you can. Um, I guess Simo is now going back for more resources. Yeah. Kind of looks like shambles to me. Mm hmm Yeah, Derp is not able to get a speed zeb skip with this map. Uh, the room before Mother Brain just didn't have um enough runway to charge a spark. So Which is so, why yeah. I'm saying that Ice yeah. Beam was kind of very important. Oh yeah, Ice is very important, but also Varia is important. Hence why oh, absolutely. Is Mother Brain and Simo's not. But yeah, Derp gets through mb1 and just has to deliver 24 charge shots to mother brain 2 and we'll be out of here and let's talk about 
Because I think one thing we really haven't done yet is talk about how qualifiers go. Oh yeah, go for it. So, as MM2 has very nicely explained to me before things got started, the qualifiers, you basically can go and you get, if you play in every qualifier, you only get, what, your two best times? So anything no. over... Th yeah. I, no. You can only, you can only yeah. play in three? So the way it works is, however many you play, you drop mm -hmm. your worst and everything else is averaged. Um, That's you're required it. to play at least two. If you play two qualifiers, both your times are averaged. If you play three, you get your worst time dropped. And then beyond three, you get no more advantages from playing more. So all your times, um, except your worst, are averaged. And that's your score. Well, all the scores are average since we use a par time system to calculate so scores so that um, it's more equal between different seeds. We had Derp in the escape now, took care of Mother Brain handily, and just got to head out of Wreck Ship and down Criteria, and then we'll be out of here. Yep. And Simo finding Bomb Terizo. Yeah, with the third reserve tank. So. Getting better equipped for Ridley, but still not quite there yet. Nope. Looking good so far from Derp on the escape. Yeah, I just got a few more rooms. I th this is like Croc Shaft, I think. Um, and then. 230 hallway? Yeah. Yep, 230 hallway. Fun fact, West I Ocean. can actually shoot out those bomb blocks. So. Fun fact, I did not know that. Yeah, Hyper shoots up bomb blocks, super blocks, and power bomb blocks. Um, and then speed is for speed blocks. But Dirk is going to be finishing in second place overall, first on the restream with a time of 46 minutes and 25 seconds. Nicely done. Yeah. GG's Derp. Bressingham actually finishes in first place with an official time of 45 minutes and 56 seconds. A 29 second difference between Bress and Derp. Pretty yeah. cool. So we are still waiting. We're going to see if Simo. I mean, I honestly think Simo is going to go back and try hunting Favaria. I I'm not so sure. I think. I think Seema's kind of committed to this very escape at this point, so kind of hard to justify turning around at this point. I um, just want to get over there and get the bar at, but GG's to Derp. Welcome in to the interview. GG's Derp. Hello, GG's. The Blatmaster himself. What a seed. Yeah, well, yeah, this, I feel like there's been a lot of fast map rando seeds, like, compared to how they were when I first started, but maybe... That's just being better at them. I don't know. I think it's probably a combination um, with the V113 algorithm change, um, plus the um, skill increase in everybody. I'd believe it, yeah. Yeah. But they did take out some like uh, hard stuff in Hard Tricky. Makes sense, makes sense. But yeah. Um, I... The difference between you and Simo was uh, you decided to hunt majors with Godvard, and Simo uh, did less majors in Norfair and missed Plasma and Varia, so. Oh, geez. Yeah. <laughs> Is not having a good time, has been hunting stuff for Ridley really for a while, and this is not a great fight. It's enough, I think. It's like, yeah, yeah, I... it's like 8 plus 1, but this is We're gonna find out. Count. But yeah, I tend yeah. to uh, chase majors pretty aggressively in these, like maybe too aggressively. So, you know, I saw both of the really far majors in, I think that was Meridia? It was Norfair. Norfair. Norfair, that's right. Yeah, because you didn't get Meridia map. Right, yeah. I was thinking Norfair because Aqueduct was the area. Yeah. Like the entrance to the area. But 
Yeah, I saw two on like the opposite side. I was initially just gonna go for the right one and skip the one on the left, and then I kind of realized like I have I had to go that way anyways to actually get back out. So I just checked it, and it was very. It's like wow, <laughs> this is a very easy situation from here on. I yeah. just have to find mother brain pretty much. Yeah. I was like, oh, you have to find Ridley and Mother Brain, but then I remember you already knew where Ridley was because you ran into him at the beginning. Yeah, which I'm not sure if checking all that was correct. I think I probably should have just left after bombs, but I was hoping to like spike a suit or something like that. That's, that has yeah. happened before. So. Uh, yeah, that is a known thing to have happened. Anyways. Yeah, instead, I ran yeah. into a passageway I couldn't cross and then Ridley, so. Yeah. But I mean, the Ridley knowledge did end up helping. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I would have gotten it anyways from the oh, yeah. map. But... That's true. I forgot. Lol. And we never got to see Torian. I don't think we saw Brunstar either. At least not from me. Yeah. Simo did. Simo did find Brunstar and it had like a major in fluff it was planned. And... Ice Beam. Yeah, it was Ice. That's right. That's right. Oh, but it wasn't great. Because the only way you were getting to the Brinstar was through Rex Ship. Yep. So you, you did Rex Ship at the end, but Simo didn't. Yeah, I mean, that was a little bit lucky, I think. I was like, gonna, I saw the map was really far away. I decided to commit to it anyways, because I figured it'd probably be a bunch of like long rooms, which did end up being the case. But uh, there, <laughs> like, there were four areas, I think, that Mother Brain could have been in. So I got pretty lucky that it was in the first one I checked. Yeah. Yeah, because it was Warp. that, Wreck Ship, Brinstar, or Turian, which is a lot of areas. Well, could have been in Meridia, right? Because I never got the Meridia map. Yeah, yeah, Brinstar, Mer yeah, Bryn, Wreck Ship, Meridia, Turian. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Steam finishes nine minutes in the future, so I'm going to see if Steam wants to do an interview. Let's go, let's go. We had to Simo live calm his own Ridley fight. Hold up. Yes, please. I will I will go on mute. I want to hear this. <laughs> fight looking way better from Simo. Zemo still really need to be careful. Really needs to be careful. Ridley is cooperating. Yeah, this is looking like about time, so honestly. No kidding. This is Simo's third or fourth attempt. Nicely done. Bye bye, Ridley. Um... Yeah, pause, the the pause. Oh, ho, ho, ho. clutch. Good pause, Simo. Wow. Yeah, she's making good a game. really good point. Look at, look at the race yeah. time room. The yeah. between sixth, seventh, and eighth, there is a six second difference. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, I saw that. But no, between fifth and eighth. Because Lunar is a nasty tied. No, I can't no. remember. That was a minute apart. I almost said I, the I, same I, thing. <laughs> I, said, I read 530, and I was like, oh. Yeah, That's what that I read. Simo really said. Anyways, welcome, Simo. Simo! How's it going? Yeah. I, I forgot that I saw Ridley, so, you know, <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> yeah. I thought I was going to go into Torian and pick up some more stuff, and then I saw Ridley and Criterion, and I was like, oh, hmm. Would you like to know where Varya was? Uh, I think it was probably one of the two majors I'd left in Norfair or whatever. Yep. 
Yeah. Especially looking at the finish times, people just, you know, they got their gravity and they went down and then they just did everything. <laughs> yeah. Also, the other one I did. Plasma, so everything was just easy. I don't need those technically. You know, they would have helped. Yeah. Same time. I mean, I went the wrong way, I think, to begin with. I yeah. Mean, uh, if I had went down first, uh, that's how you get times like, I guess, like breaths and derp. Yeah, he like went super... down uh, to Meridia and then Norfair. Yeah. So he did Meridia, found Dragon, then left and didn't find the Meridia map. And then. Um, what? Yeah. Mania. Yeah. And then um, he went to Norfair and found the bosses and found the um, items and found Varian Plasma. <laughs> yeah, the items in question were Varian Plasma, so pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> pretty sick. Good strat. Find the items. <laughs> yep. That is kind of my hard. my plan with these. I just try to like, find the items. I like my first attempt at Ridley. I like move too soon, and the the particles just moved, and I just left. I was like, no, nah, I'll just go find something else. Help me out a bit more. There wasn't really anything that good near Ridley. Just the E tank and the reserve. Not sure how far the restream is. A long time. 10 minute delay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but I, mean, I don't remember what I was doing 10 minutes ago. You know, I, I don't have that well, kind of memory. You can watch the restream if you'd like. <laughs> no, 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 that's, that's crazy. Yeah. I'll get, Actually, I'll get a uh, no, you can't. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to DQ you for that. Get got. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Can you feel the love, Simo? Yeah, I got to have fun. That's what matters. There you go. <laughs> Aww. Do Isn't that nice? Actors. I had a cool Dragon fight, you know. Yeah. Hey, going well. Would not say I had a cool Dragon fight. Man. I gotta say. Yeah, you uh, did not have a cool Dragon fight. No, you did not. It, it started out <laughs> well, and then I it didn't end well. But Yeah. <laughs> you know. Yeah, you had a, um experience with Dragon to Man. be sure. Did you even get the ice bean? The ice no, bean I did not. Wow. <laughs> no, I had like didn't. barely enough ammo to actually finish without Zepstick <laughs> either. It really was. <laughs> yeah. Actually, that's not true. I found a bunch of supers at the end, so it was yeah, fine. I was gonna say you like didn't, and then you like it wasn't close. But also, you can always just farm. Just sometimes those farm spots suck. Mm-hmm. I'm not really sure where I'm farming supers in this situation. I think Bress said he was farming missiles in climb. Nice. Oh, wow. Oh, that's sick. The There's green, so many pirates, the honestly. Okay. Yeah, I mean, true. It does work if you have full health. Or sometimes even if you don't. But okay, yeah. Um, any final thoughts from the both of y'all before we close this off? It was fun. I hope I at least got to do something cool for Restream. <laughs> you, you got to be you, cool. Simo. You got to yeah, be you. All right. All right. Derp. Uh, yeah, GG's. Shout out to whoever set up the Restream and put the picture of my cat instead of my webcam on the <laughs> let's go see i saw your webcam i was like i could do that or i could just put your cat up there because that's funnier yes it is funnier i'll agree with you there yeah also i realized that you're looking to the right which is away from the center no i can't remember which i'm just looking at my my items seeing what i have yeah sure you yeah you're just looking to the right instead of your cat looking to the right but no, I just did that to be obtuse on purpose. So, you're Let's welcome. Go. Anyone that's watched Derp streams before knows about Derp's cat picture. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, I, I think remember... somebody in chat said I should set up a slideshow. And honestly, I have so many good... Yeah, that was Salmonster. And yes, you should. It'd be hilarious. <laughs> but yeah. Cool. Okay. MM2, anything else for you? I got nothing else. Um. Yeah. Eventually. Think, yeah. I think that does it for all of us. So yeah, from everybody here at Speed Gaming, thank you for watching and 
uh, on behalf of the Super Metroid Map Rando Tournament, we will see you at the next qualifier Tuesday at 9 p.m. Eastern. So yeah, see you next mission.